And if only I had some kind of tree farm. I was expecting with nature. We'd be able to auto-grow trees or something fantastical like that. Alright. Gather space. Alchemy lab. Learn aqua. What is this going to be? Workshop artifacts go back to this thing. That'll give me more anyway. Uh, let's see. What else do I invest in? I don't know. Just a couple, a bunch into magic book. Just see if I get anything else. Because I know there's thalmic synergy I could go for. There's greater craft. But I think, is it a new spell? Here we go. Okay, Aqua. Whoa. That's expensive. Transfigure. Uh, lose knowledge, gain control. We also have these two. Oh, but that requires aquatic blasting. Conjure Aqua requires 23k. I have enough. I just gotta wait. Okay, Conjure Spring. Well, there, there be some spells. Uh, let's see. So let's nix these. Let's go gather knowledge. But I'm actually going to give it the Voltaic bonus just in case turns out we need it. And then Conjure Spring. Oh boy, that's expensive. Uh, what was what was the other one? Transfigure. 23k to get get it. Oof. Well. It's gonna take a bit. Oh. I could also learn Scholar. So extra power. Ah, better experience rate. You know what? I just kind of don't care. And there's Transfigure. Pricey. Pricey, pricey, pricey pizza. Well. Yeah, I'm just going to be kind of chilling and leveling up my space anyway. I don't actually know what we're using space for at this moment. But I might as well expand it. Okay. Fortunately, it scales kind of slowly. But I might as well grab another urn of expansion if I get the opportunity. There we go. Okay, so these are grossly expensive. I guess let's stop expanding space for a bit. I might even want to skip away from expanding space. Because I could work on leveling, and eh, I don't know. It's there. Okay. That should give me a whole bunch of this. Oh. Yeah, it's expensive. Burn mana just to get both of those. And it looks like it can burn decent chunks of both. Might as well grab some dexterity and some memory while we're here. Okay, then just keep keep converting that over. Brewing station. What? Water plus conjure. Brew. What is this going to do? Well, it's going to take a while. That's what it's going to do. Okay, so we now have transmutations, transmute knowledge. Okay, oh, just automatically convert mana into knowledge. Automatically converts mana into wood. Because that, oh, oh, boy. Okay, so now we can get automatic generation for knowledge and mana, both of which are going to be incredibly useful going forward. I'm going to start with 
Yeah, I don't know. Okay, we brewed. We now have whatever this is. Knowledge brew. Okay. For 12 seconds, knowledge gains. How do I drink it? Or am I drinking it? I have no idea. But that'll make another one. Now let's keep going down the list. Keep making new things. Okay. Am I transmuting transmuting wood now? Yes, I am. Open inventory, bottom left. Oh, here we go. How do you drink? Or, I just, okay, I just quaff it there. Okay. I'm just going to keep grabbing that until we've got somewhat of a reasonable level of wood transmutation. Yeah, unfortunately the potions aren't that... I, I'm sure they're great. I'm just not super passionate about them. Grab these. Uh, let's see. Grab a little bit more. Might as well grab transmute knowledge. Okay, back to casting. Do I know how to upgrade transfigure? Yes. A conjure spring. Alright. It's doable. Like how this aspect in introduces one inactive method of play and one active to suit both types of players. Though you have to do the active one. Oh, the water, the water drops off. That's unfortunate. Oh, well. Oh, moly. That's expensive. Okay, well, considering I'm here, I might as well upgrade these a bunch. It's very expensive to cast these spells, though. Eh, kind of. Okay. So if I go back to upgrade spells... Upgrade this again. I might as well just upgrade it a ton of times. Okay, and Conjure Space is now... Egregiously expensive, but it does give me big space. And let's just grab a couple of those. I'll probably nix it from the list. Uh, let's see. So what else can we do? Advanced transmutations, but that's going to require dexterity and a fair bit of other things. Okay, so let's go back to the workshop briefly. We want Scholar's Book. Oh, infusion is beyond expensive. Either way, why is my mana gain higher? What happened? I don't know, man. It went up. Intellects make it go up too. Dang. Well. I guess let's get a couple points into infusion. Uh, let's see. Anything else I was going to invest into? There's the commanded bandwidth, which would be nice, but kind of expensive. Control casting. Uh, I've got to increase my, my potion capacity, though. Let's grab these now that I have... Manual gain on both. Okay, orb stand, magic book for extra capacity. What we want are scholars' books. Oh, but I need I need mad wood. 
I guess I might as well just cast this at, at somewhat periodically. There we go. Grab more of these. Ooh, those automatic automagic tomes are expensive. What else was I doing? Oh, we're out of water. That would certainly do it. And that's the wrong button for water. Okay. Because, yeah, I should go back to messing with all of these. Probably also take a look at this. Uh, is this our current one? Yeah. yeah. Scholar's Alchemy. Oh. I can't get it. But it will actually give me just free control by existing. Which is kind of nice. Okay, new potion. Memory mixture. Interesting. Start brewing the next one. I'm just here to find out what these all of these things do. Okay, alchemist. So now we have metabolism. Extra base potion duration and power. And brewing speed and brewing power. Oh, I might as well just invest into all of those. Give me more more water. Mas agua. Okay, so advanced conversion. Use your skills as an alchemist to improve your transmutations. And also transmute more complex resources like water and space. Might as well grab that for the uh the extra capacity. Oh. We also have a mana mana potion. Okay, that's useful. Uh let me go back to brewing for the time being. I'm just gonna keep brewing whatever. Okay, I might as well boost so we get even more. More agua. Get cauldron. We'll travel. Keep boosting my metabolism. Potion pouch. Five inventory slots. I'll take it. Kind of expensive, but what else am I using it for anyway? Okay, back to the workshop. Effective learning. Oh. Yeah, there's a couple of these upgrades that have just popped up. And I very much would like to make the most of them. Structures, can I get another? No. Nuts. Fine. More paper. Another one of these. Another Thalmic scroll. And I'd like to get another auto magic just because I'm here. Uh, what else do we have? Because that's too expensive. Might as well keep leveling that up. Oh, dimensional prowess. Base space quality. The only immediate problem is. Oh, there's also dimensional control. But yeah, I gotta increase my capacity for this junk. And I currently can't do that. Let's see. We also have memory. Eh, it's a thing. Okay. And we need more water. So I should probably go for the boost. What does this stone do? Uh, it gives a... It gives a benefit to, uh, to certain stats, I think. Oh, that does actually go up. Unfortunately, these have a limited amount of power, so I have to swap between them somewhat actively. And I forget to do that... ...constantly. I... <laughs> Sucker's leveling fast. I, uh, might have put off working with it maybe a little too long. Okay, what is that? I have no idea. Power potion. Interesting. 
I'm just gonna keep investing in whatever. Trying everything. More water. Okay. So I can actually get up to advanced conversion and transmutations, but I need a, just a little bit more capacity on either. Oh, there's another auto magic tome. And more, more paper. Actually, maybe we go back to this. Do I want some more wood? Maybe. Why did this suddenly go so much more expensive? What, what is happening? Okay. Why is my maximum mana capacity so heavily reduced? What is with my gain? It's not like this is going up, is it? In cost? Oh, maybe it is. Nope. Not sure. Okay. Let's stop this. Let's go storm. Brew the last potion. I think I'll just leave it on mana potion. Because that seems like the most useful thing. Okay. Grab those. Back to just getting paper. Man. Remember how like 20 minutes ago I was just manually mashing things so I could generate all of this stuff? Oh, I'm no, no longer using the mana cost reduction amulet. That's what happened. I was confused. I was like, I shouldn't be able to afford things. The answer is, oh uh, yeah. That's why I can or can't. I guess I should be investing in aptitude at this point. It's not a huge boost, but getting both of those seems like a good idea. Oh, we have hit the automation side of this and I love it. Oh, transmute has negatives. Oh, does it? I mean, I know I know it costs me per second. I don't see what the other negatives are, frankly. But no, it's just that my uh, my maximum capacity seems to be just going up over time, and I'm not actually sure why. Oh no, never mind. It's thaumaturgy. It's thaumaturgy. I'm a goof. Yeah, so the less thaumaturgy... Wow, that is actually very, very noticeable. I'll have to level that up some more. When we get there. Yeah, I'll just keep that in mind that that's actually a, a very heavy limitation that I have to work around. Let's see. Ooh, those are expensive. Everything is. Uh, what am I doing? I don't know. I'm all over the place. I'm lost and I'm confused. This whole alchemy business has added dimension to this game. Uh, it's... Oh, gosh. What do we even do after this point? We just wait. Because I think we want advanced transmutations... An advanced conversion. Oh, but my maximum capacity is a little rough. What does a lightning tonic do? We just start brewing mana potions. So, extra cooldown speed and casting speed. What if there's a way that I could just transmute water? Grab that. Boost. Grab. Wait for the mana to come back. And yeah. Gosh. Casting trends. Transmute is just 
egregiously expensive. It does give me a lot of control, though. Which is good. I gotta figure out how to up my maximum capacity on that. Uh, let's see, but I'm not seeing anything that specifically gives that, that function. So it's either got to be a feature I don't have yet. Well, we could get dilated. Longer duration, longer cooldown, but not as much. Let's see. Do I invest into some of these? I mean, memory is worth investing into, yeah. And infusion. Let's just grab some of these. Because I might as well upgrade them as I go by. Just boost my gain. Okay, back to this. Because, yeah, like I said, I'm flailing a little. I don't know where all this extra... Pow oh, the power is coming from this, of course. Wow, that actually generates a ton of power. Like, that's enough that I I can just generate eff effectively one wizard wood, or one cast worth of wizard wood constantly. Uh, this is what I should be investing towards now I'm thinking about it. Oh, and we could actually save up and grab Thalmic, Sy Thalmic Synergy at this point. Okay, what else do we have? Because it feels like I'm, I'm missing some some major progression thing, and I'm not quite sure where it is. It's probably got to just be these. It's just brewing endlessly. Because I might as well try and have as much water as I possibly can. Which means I got to keep casting that. Try and level it up for further and faster, but... Eh. What was the... Right. It was this. I want effective learning. Because that increases both proficiency and capability. Yeah, I mean, it's good. It's scaling some... It's scaling stuff. I should probably also just do... Endless paper. That's a lot of paper. Another auto magic tome? Yeah. We want more of those. Whoa. Oh, I see, because I had too much. And so it was just ticking down at a, an advanced rate. Magic book up, up to level 10. I know there are a couple of things that can be unlocked based on... Let's see, a number of things that can be unlocked just based on... Uh, you know, having X amount of each. And I wonder if I'm ignoring an upgrade or two. Okay. Keep grabbing more water. Hopefully, eventually, we can get just more water as base. How do I increase your capacity? So if I can get my control capacity beyond, I could potentially get that. I could just push for more. Grab a bit of both of those. Keep leveling some things up. Uh, let's see. So what do I need for the clock? Notes have to be level 15. And honestly, we're getting there. It's still expensive. I just cast that once. No, I'll have to cast it twice. Give me another wizard wood. Couple of those. All deal. Do I want to get some more cauldron? Yes. Do I want to transmute more wood? Maybe. 
I feel like I should be casting some things at this point, but I'm... Uh, I don't want to say I'm kind of in this, like, fugue state now where I'm just kind of like... But if I don't touch it, it grows anyway. So maybe I just don't touch it and I wait and I watch. And I will be fine. I might want to level up that spell, though. Yeah, Contra, Contra Spring can be upgraded. Oh, can can be it. I definitely have to cast a Transfigure, though. Let's just pop one of those for a little bit more. I wonder if there's, like, an auto-cast button or option. That actually would be a really nice feature, being able to auto-cast certain spells. Hey, thank you, Koga Wolf, for the 44-month resub. Damn, thank you. And thank you, THX, for the, what is that, 43-month resub. And nobody in particular for the 23-month resub. Thank you, guys. Almost two years. How's life treating everyone lately? <laughs> I'm a little late on responding on that one. I apologize, but eh, life's been good, good enough for me. I'm packing... Well, I'm packing up. Shell's been doing most of the heavy lifting there. Let's see. And so we're... We're packing-ish to move cross-country. Okay. Was I going to mess with this? Improved brewing. I don't know where I got that from, but... It's cool. I've got it. It doesn't look like it can make more. And I'm going to need just tons of water. Uh, da, 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 da. I probably should have grabbed... Oh, wait. Transmute more comple complex resources like water and space. Okay, so we want to save up for that. So let's go back. Magic. Let's actually swap this out because I'm not using it. I've kind of given up casting spells at the moment. And I should probably go back to it. I can just... Like I said, in kind of a fugue state. Where stuff is just going on and I'm just kind of here for it. Might as well get some more water. Might as well cast all of these. Okay, advanced transmutations. So in that case, if we go back over here, uh, enrich brew, extra max potion level, an alchemic compound, but also transmutations. Transmute water is a little expensive. However, seems like it's worth it. I just got to get there. I don't think I care about transmuting space. I don't think that's going to be something I invest towards for quite a while. Oh, boy. Let's see, aptitude, no. Just kind of invest towards various things. An egregious amount of paper. And yeah, let's keep getting Thalmic scrolls, because I'm going to need tons of them anyway. Uh, one of these required like 15 notes. Yeah, but I'm also going to need a lot of other capacity that I just currently do not have. Grab an orb stand, maybe. Oh. Recast this. Uh, do I grab the Thalmic volume? Maybe. I don't actually... Oh, no. Now I have enough wood. There we go. Because I should be... I should be investing some more into sturdy wood. Resonators and the carpentry stands, which are kind of expensive. Let's grab that. Because I want to transmute water. I'm going to have to transmute so much, though. But at least it means we're getting some amount of brewing progress. Using items. Ah. wonder if there's a way to automate potion. Suffers from too much stuff to do overload. It does. It feels like one of those that, after a certain point, you have to just kind of sit down and say, uh, I've hit my limit for the day. Let's just chill for a little while, and then... Like, come back, 
come back and take another crack at it. Okay, enrich brew? Sure. Oh boy. That costs a lot of resources. Yeah, there's also that one, but... Oof. Grab the carpentry station. Collar book. Satchels. I don't know. All of these are... All of these are pricey business. Going for this stuff. Might need a little bit more gating. I think it had plenty of gating. I think it's just a matter of I've been playing this for God, three or four hours now. Like I was gonna, I was gonna switch back to uh, random idler games just for a little while, just just because. But this is this is consuming in honestly a very good way. Uh, let's see. All right. I should I should be doing this. Just letting um letting my mana stack up and getting as many points in infusion as I can. Uh gosh. Cuz yeah, the next next order of business would be saving up enough that I can afford fierce intellect cuz that would drastically increase my knowledge per second, I think, from intellect. Or maybe it wouldn't. It's really hard to tell. Yeah, what else what else am I missing? Because I I still feel like there's something here they gotta find. It's probably just further under the alchemy tree. Namely these two. I mean they're doable. Okay. I have a little bit too much, but I'll wait. So, oh, wait, here it is. Base control capacity. So, that's that's what I got to afford. So, I need I need 120 paper. Actually, very doable. All right, there we go. I was wondering how I was going to get some progress. Hey, and that actually reduces the reduces the overall cost of anything that requires control. Still expensive, but achievable. Doesn't mean I'm going to need more wood, though. Let's see. Go for some more effective learning? Sure. Because, yeah, there was at least a couple of these that are very expensive. Namely, controlled casting. Ah, uh, sure. I'll stick it out. We'll get controlled casting and then we'll stop. Because this is not going to take too long. Uh, in that case... Do I want to swap up my mana gain? The problem is I want to keep transmuting water. But it pricey. Yeah, the cloak artifacts, but they're kind of pricey. Yeah, at this point I could potentially afford Thomic Synergy. Transmute wood, transmute knowledge, transmute water. Probably just keep transmuting water. Eventually, we're going to get it so that it, I can just have a constant flow of potions. Maybe too many. But then it'll cap out and I can turn it down. Or maybe it just stops rolling for a moment. <sighs> Control casting. Or crafting. Okay, now I have too much of that. So I might as well keep grabbing. Keep grabbing everything. Keep going for more control. Because yeah, I can at least in invest in a couple of these. Oh! And let's go back to workshop for a hot second. Because if I get two of these, I'll have to do one, uh, one more Thalmic scroll. Then we can get actually quite a number of things. That's a, there's a portion, potion limit of 120 and doesn't stop when you hit that limit. Ah, that's unfortunate. That's fine. Okay, nope. One more Thomic volume. Or if I go back here, we could potentially invest in memory a couple of times. 
kind of. Okay. Keep chugging that. Because we want to keep increasing our base potion duration. It lasts for 30 seconds now. Let's see. I might just have to tell that to stop at some point. Let's see. Magic book. Base magic skill. And now I've already... I've already lost track of my goal. And we're getting there on Fierce Intellect. Hey, next level of infusion. That's good stuff. Right. That's what I'm trying to do. Everything else is secondary. I'm just trying to get enough paper. Let's see. Grab a mana potion. Oh yeah, and I, I definitely could get a 100% uptime on my potions. Oh shoot. I actually have enough paper. Okay, there we go. So now we go back to the workshop. Artificer? Yeah, I'll go here. Just to invest a couple in memory. So now I just need one more. And also to get controlled casting, which is very much within reach. Okay, so I have enough control for that. Enriched brew is very pricey. Back to workshop. It was... which one? I'm lost. No, it wasn't this. Ah, it was advanced conversion. Boy, I need an endless amount of paper. But if I can do it, everything will be peachy. Okay, let's go back to magic. I need more wood than dexterity. Or, or is it agility at this point? Whoops, that's the wrong one. Conjure wood. Swift wood. There we go. Let's see, I'm channel surfing. I clicked on this because the channel is not running Elden Ring. Is this a clicker? Uh, it's not a clicker, but it is an incremental game. They're very similar and often are the same thing. Um, okay, there's the volume. So now this can go up. Go back here. I mean, I guess there is an amount of clicking that is involved, but it's only, almost always just in regards to resource acquisition. Okay, get some extra control. Let's go back here for a hot second. I might... might have been... that was too much. Oh well, it's fine. Complexity of this game would fry my brain. Um, yeah. It's frying mine. I'm actually kind of shocked I'm doing okay considering headache. Okay. So I can actually do controlled casting and I should probably cast that. Alright, get that now first. There is no cookie to click. It's true. Controlled casting. What does that even do? I... What? Enables double casting, which sometimes... Which causes non-toggled spells to sometimes chain cast. Chain casts are less powerful. Uh, let's just get Scholar just because. Aqua Crafting. More powerful Aqua Spells. More Aqua Spells. Arcane Dominion. There's Fierce Intellect, which we're getting close on. And we also have Advanced Conversion. Okay, so we can now use my skills as an Alchemist to improve somehow. I, I, I'm lost, man. Here we go. Transmutation effectiveness. Ooh, reduced base transmutation cost and increases transmutation speed.
There we go. Conjure some more of this. Transmutation speed. So is that... Okay. I'm not entirely sure how that works. I think it increases the overall cost per second, but also the production by a little bit. It's just a little confusing. Can't pause? You don't need to pause. This is not the kind of game that matters. Okay. And just burn mana, get more control. Might as well get a little bit of efficiency. Not that it really matters too much. Hey, and we can even get the potion pouch. Which means more potions, which I'm not using and I should be using. And unfortunately, a lot of these are point based. It's fine. So is this memory mixture versus knowledge brew? I think it's this, oh, it's capacity versus gain. Let's just start making some of these. They're a little cheaper anyway. Oh, level two potion. Okay, I'll just grab that. At least for now, what else do we have? This game is, ah, concentration. Base control gain, base mana quality, base duration. Okay, I mean, that seems reasonably good. Okay, might as well also invest in dexterity for the time being. Okay, we have more for the loadout, I think. Maybe not. Discover, we're still a little ways on. What does alchemy have? It's telling me about potions and cauldrons and stuff, but that's not what I'm here for. What about workshop? Have we unlocked anything new here? No. All right. Well, at this point, this is breaking my brain and I'm pretty tired. So I think it might be a good time for me to call it quitsies and come back to this another day uh, when I'm feeling a little bit more wizardy. I'm having a good time. This is incredibly solid. It just... It's a lot. It keeps... It keeps scaling, man. It keeps giving me new things to, to play around with. And it's... Wild. Okay. Whoa, hi. We got another donation. Uh, actually, a couple. Thank you, uh, Anonymous, for the $20 donation to uh, UNICEF in the heart. Thank you. Thank you, Trooper Bari, for the $100 donation as well. And thank you, Red Fox, 71. I'm sorry I missed all of those. I look over occasionally. Uh, but you guys are champions. Seriously, all of you.